Oh, good morning, YouTube. What's happening, man? It's uh, Saturday, <clears throat> March 11th. We are still in New Mexico. We went to the missions yesterday. So fascinating. Um, we're going to do a couple of local hikes today. We're going to stay in the area. We're not going to travel out. We drove like three hours yesterday there and back. So <clears throat> we're going to keep it close to the camper. Um, but I'm going to turn it on when we get there. What up there, YouTube, baby? We got over here to the, uh, I forgot the name of it. Salt. Salt Creek Wilderness National Wildlife Refuge. I'm not good at remembering the name. But I'm about to put my long sleeve on. We're going to hike for a while, man. Uh, we put water. How many? Oh, my God. I can't carry all this water. Like six, maybe eight. Anyway, we're getting ready to take this little trail. And uh, I'll turn it on here. Actually, I'll probably just keep it rolling and take it with me. I normally put on long sleeves when I'm hiking and stuff. Um, because I don't like putting on a bunch of sunscreen. It's real greasy and stuff. You know, I just, if there's any sunscreen companies out there that want to send me some. That's not greasy. Stick on me like cream. I'll try. But until then, I'll be uh, putting on long sleeves. Waters. We bought these shirts at Tractor Supply. They're cool shirts, but the buttons go on different. I think they were made for a lefty. Got the kids up, got them ready to go, and then uh, we had to stop and replenish our water supply. We ran out yesterday. So, hey, what water you put in here? Sheesh. Eight. Hey, that's more than eight. And I'm gonna tell y'all, uh, this water I started buying at actually in a. Louisiana. It's Ozarka. That's some good stuff, man. I really like it. You ready, J-Boy? The girls are ahead of us already. But look, I'm going to tell you, this is one of the things we have a problem with here in New Mexico is actually finding trails. Like, there's stuff that pops up everywhere. But it's like spots like this. Do you legit pull off the main road up here come down there ain't no parking it's all fenced but there's signs that say go hike i mean and there's a trail there's a trailhead there's everything but it's all fenced for cattle i guess so we've had to really dig in and look for these little spots that we want to come and see but i'll say man i love new mexico wide open space just i mean views as far as you can see can't complain Chelsea playing in dirt Chelsea playing in the dirt you good above yep. alright cool J-Boy back there. Let's do this. I got my photographer on hand. She takes all the greatest pictures. Coming is awesome. And coming soon. They should be available. Oh, I don't doubt it. I bet there's horses all the time. My guess is it's like a one of those split use properties. Oh. Yeah, old Chelsea girl, she found out yesterday. Pants are a good thing when you're out here in the deserts. 
she got some she got some stickies on her a bear So where's the trail go? Did you see where the trail went? And see, the funny part is Deborah knows I don't care. I'll walk out into the expanse. It doesn't bother me. I'll just walk. I don't need a trail. And actually, one of the things that I didn't know about New Mexico was the salt trade in the early days. You know, a lot of the lakes had salt lakes. So it's really cool. Um, like even the stuff right here is all white. It's cool, it's really cool. That was one of the Pueblo's biggest trading commodities was the salt from the salt lakes. I think that's awesome. I'm just gonna peruse for a minute, see what happens. I am a little upset I left my gator at home. It's windy. That's one thing about here. Wind. It's pretty much been non-stop since we got here. I'm not a fan. start walking so. and this happens on every trail just so you know we start and they're like oh wow that's <laughs> my dude what's up dude what's up what's up, up bruh there's some poop right there poopy Too old for what? Too old for them to still be here. Who? The horses. How do you know? Because it was fresh. Did you touch it? No. Did you see if it was still warm? No, ew. Well, how do you know it's old? Because I couldn't smell anything and there were no flies. The wind's blowing. It's not going to blow up in your face. See that pile? That looks old. I'm just messing with each other a little bit. actually riding back from the missions yesterday man I still that was awesome but um, we were on this back road and we had rode 20 minutes 30 minutes seeing nobody nothing well as I'm going down the road the road turns it bends but you can go straight I told Deborah, I said if I get over there no mailbox I'm going there was a mailbox <clears throat> so i dropped one of our cards in there wrote him a little note told him what you know what we're doing and all that i'd love to come explore your property so hopefully i'll hear from that dude that'll be awesome lagging
YouTube. We're gonna walk for a little bit, and I'm gonna turn it back on as soon as you know. I, you see, if we see it, you see it. That's how it goes. And right now, you see everything we see. So we'll holler at you in just a little while. Yo, what up there, YouTube? So we have ventured pretty far out from the truck. We way over there. But there's no trail, so we just walk around. But it is turning into a rock picking vest. We found so many cool rocks. And that's just a sample, just a few of what we got already, man. But we're we're heading towards the ridge, ridges over here. And that's where a lot of those rocks come from. So we're just gonna head over this way and see what we see. The wind's picking up, man, so I'm not I'm not too happy about it. But we're having a great day, man. It's a good time. It's a good time. So we'll talk to y'all in a minute. What up YouTube man? Our journey is continuing on the rock hunt. Look at the view. Look at that view. What? I found petrified wood. Chelsea found some petrified wood. Out here in the desert, you know. Uh, but man, I I'm gonna tell you we I didn't think we'd be out here this long, but man, we had fun picking up these rocks, man. We're finding some unique stuff to us anyway. Um, it's really cool out here. But the wind, oh my God, it's, just, it's getting stronger. And I don't know how to feel about that. But what I, what I wanted to tell you is we've been out, you know, we've been picking up rocks, stuff like that, man. And I picked one up and I kind of, you know put my finger in my tongue try to wipe it off and i was like wait a second and i told there i said that it's just like salt. i mean this is the salt wildlife refuge or something like that and so like, and I, yeah salt flats man and like i told you that was a commodity back in the day for the indians so it's cool i mean it's just all over your hands and stuff man. i ain't gonna need no season in the night that's for sure but, <laughs> but i just wanted to share that with y'all well, YouTube, man, this is one of them times you got to watch where you step on. I done got one of them things all up in my shoe. Look at that. Went straight into old Doc's foot. Boy, man, that thing did not feel good. <laughs> so y'all just be careful out here. Okay? Yeah. Hey, there they go. So we've been out here couple hours man just walking around we're far from the truck man but check the terrain out we done got back up in here yeah but man, we'll find little pockets of, of rocks and we'll just stop my dumb self i didn't have my shovel i don't have my shovel with me so i can't really dig. i probably took it out the backpack and then Stuff like this, man. We find we got a lot of these right here, man. But we have found some amazing, amazing rocks. And when we get back, I'll be sure and turn it on and show y'all our collection. And it just so happens the other day when we were in downtown, it's on the video if you watch it. Um, Ancient of Days Rock Shop. Dude was really cool and he seemed like he would be able to help us out. So. We're going to take him up there probably one day this week and see if he can tell us anything about what we have. But man, it's, it's awesome. Dude, we're out here just in the middle of nowhere. We're chilling. It's great. What you think? It's awesome. It it's is. It's pretty cool out here. And dude, there's nobody out here. Nobody. So, I'm loving it. But -da 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 -da, I'm loving it. <laughs> Whoa. what up you two so we're walking we're starting to head back toward the trail to get back to the truck my lady my lady done did it we done found us an antler out here man we've been picking up rocks we've been looking everywhere for some bam set of antlers and now what's up that's awesome man Good it got some weight to it. Bring it with us. Come on. 
So, hey, man, you just never know what you're going to find, man. You never know what you're going to find out here. That's what's up, man. Well, YouTube, what we going to got back in the truck, man? Um, I think we spent a little over five hours. About nine, see, 10, 30, 11, 30, 12, 31, four hours. Four and some change. Um, it's 12 30. So. Oh, my thing was wrong. Right. Four hours. We'll call it four. It was at least three. Exaggerate. She knows nothing about exaggeration. No, I'm kidding. Um, I don't know. I don't keep time. But, yo, he's like Deborah was talking about. We were walking. And I turned around and she's like, we need to start heading back. I said, well, I don't want to go back. I'm enjoying myself. She said, oh, no. We started walking. I. I finally did catch a glimpse of, of the truck sitting way out. I'm like, dang, we walked a long way. <laughs> she always the one to bring me back, man. But we're going uh, to take a break. I think we're going to grab some lunch, and then uh, I'll turn it back on for y'all.